Hello friends. Okay, uh, today mm, I'm going to show you uh, another application of image processing, what we call it forgery detection. And uh, this time I have used the classifier neural network because uh, I, I had uploaded one of the one of the type of this video previously uh, using support vector machine. Maybe neural network um, getting popularity these days, um, specifically deep learning. Uh, in this video, what I'm going to show you, uh, the traditional neural network, uh, which we call back propagation, feed forward and cascaded type and i'm going to compare the performance of all these classifiers in case of forgery detection so uh, first uh, without wasting any time let me introduce myself this is ajayato okay and uh, we provided various services all across the globe uh, which start from thesis guidance and the uh, web development app development whatsoever it is Okay, you can get to know more about our services uh, at webtenix.com uh, uh, and infinite solution.in. You can also get online tutorial at mind creature mind creature.com. Okay, so this is all about us. Without wasting any time of you people, let me go to the straight code. Okay, here uh, there are various library. Don't get scared. Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm going to start from uh, the hardcore program. Okay, so okay, this is my user interface. I'll let you show. After all, so here I'm getting reading all the image from the folder where I stored. Uh, the uh, original and edited images let me show the, uh, these are the edited images images even or something like this uh, I'm going to show you at one of the difference of the images okay and uh, the other and at the same time uh, say I'm going to get, get the same image okay this is the original image so as you can see at uh, one side you cannot see uh, you feel that both images are same but at but uh, when you see the images more closely you can see the original image having the color intensity same as the background faces and here uh, another face is being included okay and uh, this is a forged image and uh, this portion is of image is being forced okay you can see there's a blurness in uh, eyeglasses uh, the color intensity of other faces is not matching with this person while in in this image the color intensity are the same so now what i'm uh, let me run the program i'll show you how it get perform okay this is our program I have uh, I created uh, you get to know about m more about this program uh, you can you have to visit uh, my previous video image forgery detection by illuminant color classification I'm going to uh, what I'm going to do I'm going to uh, inside of the program where I applied the neural network and this is one of the type I had applied okay Element back propagation neural network. That's a built-in function available in MATLAB 2014B. Okay, and its uh, copyright is hold by MathWork. Another neural network which I, I had applied is feed forward back propagation neural network. Okay, that is also available in MATLAB. And the last one, the cascaded back forward back propagation neural network. In all three type what I passed I pass uh, the image matrix which uh, which you'll get to know about more and the target matrix okay I created the feed forward neural network with the help of input and target matrix it will create a network which we call net 2 okay and with the help of this network I'm going to perf uh, perform the training corresponding to target matrix which I had stored in ret function that uh, in ret variable uh, uh, data matrix is being stored at Q core W 
train and net matrix also i did a little modification in the code so that i can show how the real time implementation of the system type get work okay once we deploy the pre-trained network this is our graphical user interface here you will get this get to know more about accuracy of the system type but i'm going to show i'm going to load original images at this time okay it will take some time so uh, you must keep some patience okay more patience you keep more knowledge you get okay uh, let me load the edited images first the feature extraction okay this is the color element face mapping as you can see the voila jones back voila jones face recognition algorithm is running back at the background which would be able to classify each face from uh, an image okay it is being highlighted the display is getting more colorful because we are but at the background but i'm i'm taking i'm taking rgb to love illuminant mapping one of the practical application of this forgery detection uh, can be seen at uh, criminal site where the people claim to be present somewhere else while uh, he he was he he he's become he's he's one of the criminal okay so yeah last time previously i supported uh, the government to help to resolve some of the cases where my classify uh, forgery detection system works well and able to detect uh, the person whether the person is forged or not government mean local government <laughs> yeah this will take time so by the next time while the program is running you will see the accuracy of neural network and the next time i'll show how deep learning can change the performance of the forgery detection system and uh, yeah that will be the title of my next video Yeah, my senior has just arrived and they want to talk to me but let me complete the video first and here i apply the classification algorithm okay the sequentially my, i obtain each of the neural network i already explained every part of neural network so let me close these things you can get the performance of ne neural network by clicking the regression plot okay as well as the performance by clicking on performance here you will see i'm um, getting the optimum performance as 30 poke we are uh, as well as the training is perform well because uh, there's a steep fall in the uh, train and test part okay so let me see the performance analysis what i'm getting i'm getting the accuracy around 66 percent is in case of cascaded neural network 
similar to, same accuracy I'm get, obtaining from with the help, from feed forward I'm getting low accuracy in Elman neural network the accuracy will goes up while we uh, increase the training and test data I'll do it on next video uh, while we uh, when we apply when I am going to I will apply deep learning so let me select an image let's see how much accuracy I am obtaining and that's a real-time application I do while I'll do the real-time system type I'll just select this button I already load a pre-trained network and as I obtain uh, as I pick the edited image I'm obtain it okay so meanwhile my seniors is waiting let me complete this video okay so this is Ajay Atav you can contact me anytime regarding to your research topic and web and app development okay uh, but frankly I'm telling the services are paid don't ask me to send the code free of cost because we are profit seeking organization thanks and uh, hope you enjoy the video okay I love you all